looking at how we could increase the dung beetles on my farm, I looked at a mass rearing program. Took learnings that I found in, in South Australia and Tasmania and New Zealand about mass rearing. I brought them home to my own farm, collected dung beetles and mass reared them. It did take a lot of work um, to do it, not for the faint-hearted, so it's not something I, I'd sell to other people, but if you are going at it, I would say that um, look, cheap labour is, is essential. Um, and I found, look, a few snacks and a few kids are great. Child labour is, is an excellent way of <laughs> getting stuff done. We might have had a few accidental releases, early releases, and <laughs> a few tantrums and shovels thrown, but look, <laughs> we got it done. <laughs> it was great fun getting the kids, that, that, yeah, bringing them home to their mammy at the end of the day covered in cow shit. But we also then caught this beetle up in the top left. It's a burrower. That's the one I was talking about, that bur burrows down into the soil. I had to get special permission to capture them. What I found was, uh, you can see there, top right is a fresh dung pat put into the incubator, and... Three days later, underneath it, that's the same dung pats, completely gone into the soil. So they're, they're well able to remove it when they're put in the right conditions. 